The 2020 wet season has begun in Trinidad and Tobago. We've seen a tropical wave passing by, bringing some rainfall across on the weekend. We could be seeing a couple more tropical waves later on this week. But as we said, the 2020 wet season begun and it is likely to be wetter than usual start, especially through the month of June, which means that the flood risk is elevated from June into August, which are typically the wettest months of the year. Meanwhile, for September and November, we'll still have an elevated flood risk, but particularly for southwest Trinidad, and Tobago likely to be wetter than usual towards the second half of the wet season. But right now, across Trinidad and Tobago, we still have high concentrations of Saharan dust. It will be that dusty haze that will be with you from the morning into the afternoon. Not so good news for those with asthma and pollen allergies. Out towards central and the southern parts of Trinidad, still quite hazy for the most part. Only the low chance of a shower coming by. A few cloudy patches from time to time. But overall, you'll notice the hazy conditions continuing across across North, Central and South Trinidad as we go through your Tuesday. Now, what does this mean for temperatures? Still looking at a warm 33 degrees Celsius in Trinidad, 32 degrees Celsius in Tobago. And the outlook, we'll continue to see the haze as we go through Wednesday and Thursday. But by Friday, we'll see yet another tropical wave coming by. Possibility of some showers, maybe turning thundery for the latter half of this week, particularly around Trinidad. So be mindful of that. Now, for fisher folk, we continue to see those are mainly gentle easterly winds of a 10 maybe getting up to 15 knots still a slight to moderate chop out there below two meters offshore close to one meter in those sheltered areas and even calmer in most of those areas around the gulf of paria so that's your forecast and that's from me